Hi, my name is Roberto Mickey. I'm a hand surgeon uh, here in Miami, Florida, and uh, I have a relatively simple solution uh, for some of the personal protective equipment shortages that we have in this country and perhaps even across the world. Um, basically, I've taken a standard ventilator filter, which is rated at N99. It has a 22 millimeter female adapter slash connector on this side. I've taken a simple snorkel mask with a built-in snorkel. Uh, it has uh, an intake, intake port here and uh, two exhalation portals here with valves on them to prevent uh, backflow. Uh, and uh, we created an adapter uh, which connects the two. Um, my brother-in-law, Dr. Daniel Alfonso, who's my partner in practice as well, uh, had a 3D printer and he uh, helped print this for me. Um, and we uh, basically built this on a, uh, uh, or modeled this on a um, Fusion 360, um, which is a, just a 3D modeling program, uh, and uh, created this. Um, but you can, we'll, we have the files, the 3D files for this, and we're gonna be happy to provide this you know, free of charge to anybody who wants it. Um, and we're gonna try to build for other masks. For example, this one uh, is another mask that we found online. It's, this one was $26. The one that I'm gonna show you right now is $29. Um, but this one is, uh, has a unique, uh, another uh, kind of nice feature is that this one has an inhalation port in the middle, but has an exhalation portal through the same snorkel. So uh, when we build the adapter for this one, it should have filtration for both inhalation and exhalation, which is gonna be, uh, sorry, probably better for most people. So you're not also, uh, you know, contaminating other people if you happen to have it uh, or don't know you have it. Uh, but for sort of demonstration purposes, uh, you know, of the power of a 3D printer and also uh, just a little time, uh, basically you take your mask, you take your adapter, kind of fit them together. You leave the O-ring on so that you get a nice seal. Then you take your filter and you take the 22 millimeter female male component and put them together and uh, now you've got a N99 mask with a face mask. Oh, you gotta take your glasses off. And like any mask, you have to do a fit test. So, take the filter off, put your hand on top, inspire, there's no leak. That means you have a good fit. Next, you put your filter on, because you want to check the seal there too. No leak until I let go. So that means you've got a good fit and you're protecting yourself. So, you know, this is a relatively cheap and um, simple solution uh, to protecting your face and your mouth and nose uh, from this virus. Um, and hopefully it helps a lot of people. And um, uh, this is cheap. This is $29. This is a $2 filter. This is reusable. You can clean it with bleach, um, you know, diluted bleach. And... Uh, um, you know, decontaminate it, um, and, uh, protect yourself out there. Uh, good luck to everyone. And, um, uh, we'll see you on the other side. Thanks.